Hi, Bruno Jr. here. Our podcast, Busting Addiction and Smiths, is sponsored by SafeHouseRehab.com. SafeHouse believes that traditional treatments fall short of the needs of clients who face the modern problems of addiction. Modern problems need modern solutions. Multiple addictions, multiple relapses, multiple triggers, and cheaper and more powerful street drugs set up unprecedented challenges facing treatment centers. What is needed is a more sophisticated approach, a better way forward. There are three reasons to choose our progressive modern treatment program. One, a more sophisticated intake process. Two, technology proven to enhance recovery. And three, the most robust aftercare program in our sector. To learn more, visit us at safehouserehab.com. Another myth, AA meetings are secret. There are two types of AA meetings. One is a closed meeting, which is private, not secret. You know, the difference between privacy and secrecy is that, sec- you know, when you, when you keep a secret, it's something that you're ashamed of that you don't want other people to know. That's not the case. You're not ashamed of this, but you don't want everybody to know that you're in an AA meeting, so it's called privacy. Back in the day, there was a lot more stigma associated with being an alcoholic or an addict, and to some extent, it's still true. So we respect the right of an alcoholic to feel safe in an AA meeting so that no one will disclose either the fact that that person was at the meeting or what he or she she said. On the other hand, there are open meetings where the public is invited to hear speakers talk about their experience, strength, and hope. And often, there's also an Al-Anon person there to to share the Al-Anon side of the story, which is a story told by the friends and family of the alcoholic or the addict. So open meetings are for public education, and uh, there is no secrecy in AA. We're a 501c3 not-for-profit. You can look up the books. You can you can go walk into the central office in New York and uh, ask to see you know the the books or or minutes of any meetings and so forth. So it's far more open than people believe. But we do respect the privacy of alcoholics and addicts in the process. Our podcast is sponsored by SafeHouseRehab.com, a modern approach to recovery. To learn more, visit us at SafeHouseRehab.com.